Hello, how are you doing? This is Christian once again, doing part five of my um, going through my uh, CD collection. This one, I don't have many bands, um, so I decided to put a couple of letters together it's E, F, G, and H. Um, so, without further ado, let's go and let's start with the E. Now, my only band, it's Extreme, um, this is uh, porno extreme, extreme 2 Pornography. A really good one if you can, uh, and you can uh, of course skip uh, more than words. Next, F, Faith, Faith No More, uh, the debut um, with Mike Patton, uh, The Weird Thing, Angel Dust, really good one, King for a Day, Full for a Lifetime, and the final album before the reunion and album of the year. Then we go to the F, one of my favorite bands from back in the day. This is Pass Away, a uh, subtitle album from 1983. Really, really good one. They should have been bigger. And the last studio album they put uh, before the passing of, of course, of <coughs> the late um, past Eddie Clark. This one is Eat Dog Eat with uh, Toby Jepson on vocals. Really good one is if you like a fast way, please check check one check this one out. You won't be disappointed. There it is. Now <coughs> to the F. Yep. Foo Fighters debut. There's nothing left to lose. One by one. This one is. Uh, there's nothing left to lose. Echo, Silence, Patience and Grace, Sonic Highways, and Wasting Light. That's all I have from Foo Fighters, the air band that I, right now I'm not digging very much, so I, I won't be seeking the last uh, things they have put out. Uh, right. So now we have uh, go to the G's, we have uh, Guns N' Roses, of course, Appetite for Destruction. This is a uh, Weird one because they the CD has a front cover. This one, so I decided to flip it like this. I don't know why they put this thing as a front cover. It's, uh, maybe it's uh, mispressing, mismixing. I don't know, but it's it is what it is. Uh, then we have um, use cancer, uh, use your illusions part one. My only blues um, album and my only blues artist is the one I received it uh, received um, last year, I think. Or this, I can't remember. From Chris, the blues guy. This is Buddy Guy. First time I met the blues. Really, really good one. I really dig in this one very much. Thanks, Chris. Then um, Sammy Hagar with Big Johnson with Vic Johnson. Sorry, doing some acoustic things. This one is a uh, light rose. Good one. Jimmy, Electric Ladyland. This is one of the many remasters editions they have done from this from the from Jimmy's uh, studio catalog. Really good one. And finally, one of the big, of course, one of my one of my favorite bands from back from the power uh, power metal uh, type of music. It's Halloween. This is a uh, uh, the deluxe edition is Keeper of the Seven Keys Part One and Part Two. As you can see there, it has the both uh, artworks uh, put into put into one. The guys, Keeper One, Keeper Two, and some um, ex some extras that were on the Keeper uh, Part Two. It had two uh, three bonus tracks: uh, Don't Run for Cover, Living in No Crime, and Savage. Of course, in this uh, in this fat. Your cases, please try not to break them because it, it will be impossible to replace them. There it is, the other disc. So there it is, Keepers, Halloween and Keepers 1 and 2, all in one package. Really, uh, of course, we all know this, these two albums and they are all masterpieces. So as you can see, not so many bands here on the in this part of, the, um, of my series. 
Hope you like them. Um, if if you find something you you think that interests, please put it in, in the comments. I will be more than pleased to chat with you if you think so. This is Christian <coughs> saying goodbye down here in Santiago, Chile. Until next time, see ya.